How much does it cost to live in London, UK? We're going to look at accommodation, utilities, internet, phone connection, transport and grocery costs. I've also linked in the descriptions different websites where you can find more information about each of these topics. Starting off with rent, accommodation is probably going to be your biggest expense each month and the average rent in London right now is approximately 1,800 British pounds per month or approximately 2,100 US dollars. Of course, this is the average rent and you can end up paying less or more. The average studio apartment, for example, costs approximately 1,000 pounds per month. The average one bedroom apartment costs approximately 1,300 thousand pounds per month or approximately 1535 US dollars and the average free bedroom costs approximately 2500 pounds per month or approximately 2953 US dollars per month. It is very common in London for multiple people to share an accommodation so then for example if you would be renting a free bedroom for 2500 pounds per month and each person was paying one third of the rent, you would have the equivalent of approximately 800 pounds per month. If you want to buy an accommodation in London, the average price per square meter is approximately 10,000 British pounds or approximately 11,780 US dollars. If you live in London, you also have to pay something what, which is called council tax and this takes care of things, for example, like garbage collection and so on. And on average, this costs 1,731 British pounds per year, or approximately 2,045 US dollars. The price of how much you have to pay for council tax is calculated based on the value of the house you live in. So the fancier the house you live in, the higher this council tax is going to be. In terms of energy, and here I include gas and electricity, expect to pay on average 120 to 130 British pounds per month or approximately 140 to 155 US dollars per month. If you live in a studio apartment, for example, or a smaller accommodation, this cost would only be around 70 to 80 pounds per month. For your internet connection, expect to pay between 20 to 25 pounds per month, and this will typically be with unlimited internet. If you want an internet plus TV connection, you're gonna have to pay a little bit more. Keep in mind that if you do have a TV, you also have to pay a TV license, which costs 159 pounds per year, or approximately 13 pounds per month, which is the equivalent of around 190 US dollars. For a phone connection, you can generally get a SIM only type of deal for 12 to 15 pounds per month. For groceries, expect to pay around 120 pounds per month. And you, here you can see some different prices. So for example, a pack of butter costs a pound 75. A pack of apples costs two pounds and 80. Salmon fillets cost four pounds. Free range eggs cost two pounds 30 for a 12 pack and so on. For eating out, expect to pay between 15 to 30 pounds for a meal, which does not include drinks. And for drinks such as beer or wine, expect to pay between five and six pounds per drink. In terms of transportation, the average transport cost per month are, is around 100 British pounds or approximately 118 US dollars per month. But if you buy, if you travel more than that and if you want to buy a monthly travel card for the zones one and two, that is going to cost you approximately 147.50 euros per month. Or if you want one that covers zones 1 to 5, which would be almost all of London, that would cost 252.30 pounds per month or approximately 300 US dollars. And if you want one for zones 1 to 9, that's 384 pounds or approximately 453 US dollars. And this covers all of London and some of the suburbs. Keep in mind that transportation in London is paid 
based on the zones so if you live more towards the outskirts or you're visiting friends that are live more on the outskirts you're gonna end up paying a lot for transportations so in that case it might be worth buying one of those monthly travel cards keep in mind that if you only use the buses so you don't use the metros you pay less so when you're navigating around make sure to also check on google maps what how long the bus route would take and see if that maybe you have an opportunity to save some money there in terms of going to the gym monthly pass would cost around 50 british pounds of course you can also find much more expensive gyms that cost 100 per month or even more and if you want to go to a cinema the cost is around 14 british pounds for a movie and these are all of the costs that i wanted to mention in this video